Hi everyone, my name is Mr Johns and welcome to Dance and Drama Matters. Today we're going to be learning the third part to a dance called The Climb. But it's a remix version of it, so we can get our boogie on and do some hip hop moves. So let's get going! So you heard right, this is part 3, so you should watch part 1 and part 2. And if you haven't, it's going to be really tricky for you. So go find part 1 and part 2. Watch those, learn the moves, feel really confident with them, and then come back and watch this video, ready to learn the rest of the dance. Alright, for those people that have learned all of part one and part two, you're ready to move on, so let's get going. So this is the chorus of the dance, and I wanted to make it the most fun bit, so this might be the hardest bit in the dance. So I'm really sorry if this is hard, but just take your time, I've got every confidence that you can get this, so don't worry. So our first move, we're stepping out with our left foot and in, and out with our right and in. So it just goes one, two, three, four. Now, if you feel really confident with that, put the weight on and scoop it around. But if you're not feeling very confident with it, just step out, that's fine. Just to step out and back in. You don't have to put the weight on it, but if you're feeling really confident, you can put the weight on it too. All right, so the first move goes one, two, three, four. Now our hands with that do a double scoop as we step. So it should be one, two, three, four. Now if you're just doing the step out, it'll look like this. One, two, three, four. But if you're doing the weight on the foot, it'll look like this. One, two, three, four. Up to you whether you want to do one, two, three, four, or one, two, three, four. Should we try that together? Are you ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Again, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Good work. All right, let's keep going. Actually, let's do it again, but make it a bit faster. Are you ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Again, fast. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Good work. Then this next step, this is going to be a tricky part. Take your left, you jump onto it. You lift up your right leg. Can you try that with me? Five, six, seven, eight. One, and two. Good. Five, six, seven, eight. One, and two. Try it again. Five, six, seven, eight. One, and two. And I think that actually goes on the five and six. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, and six. Now we're going to keep this knee up so that we can do two pulses. Seven, eight. Good. As we do this step forward, I want you to open your arms up like this. Can you practice that with me? One. Try it again. Six, seven, eight. One. Good. And that's actually on the five. So three. Four, five, and six, seven, eight. Let's try it from the jump again. One, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. If you're having trouble getting this knee up because you're not sure how it's working, make sure you get your weight on your right foot and you're on your toes on your left. Then you can push up, drop down, and as you drop down, you can lift that knee up. So seven, eight. Let's go from the start of what we're learning today. It goes one and two, three and four, five and six, seven, eight. Good. Right, so we're here. So let's do it one more time for good luck. You ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven, eight. Then we're here. In our next move, we're going to step forward, open our arms up. On one, two, you bring your legs together and you change sides. So it should be one, two. You cross your arms, open up, step out again. Three, four. Good, let's try that again. Five, six, seven, eight. We go one and two, three and four. And then we march back for four. Five, six, seven, eight. 
Let's try that again. We're here. We've just gone seven, eight. We go one and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. That's all we're learning today. There's no more. It just repeats. So we're going to do that whole sequence of movement three times all together. Let's try it slowly. All of the new movement. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again. One, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again. One, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, and one, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If you do your marches back, you can do big arms, whatever you want. Whatever you want to do, any punching, just no dabbing. I'm so against dabbing. All right, so that's how all of the new moves that we're learning today. So if that was tricky, that's completely fine. Watch the learning part again. Go over it, maybe in slow motion, so you can really nail it. Otherwise, we're gonna do the whole dance as it is so far. So remember, you've gotta watch part one and part two, otherwise you're gonna be really confused with these other dance moves that I'm chucking in. So, you ready to do the whole dance together? Let's go! Inside my head saying, you'll never reach it Every step I'm taking, every move I may feel Lost with no direction, I feel the shaking But oh, I gotta keep trying Alright, and I'll see you next time for the next part. Alright, bye! <laughs>